Now, uh, Professor Wahab Agbewale, Vice Chancellor of the University of Ilori, argues that uh, Nigerian public universities are not revenue generating agencies, stating that they only charge students for services like identification cards, internet, and hostel accommodations. He also notes that the University of Ilori spends about 130 million naira monthly on electricity services, a cost no public university can generate internally. Agbewale believes the federal government is already addressing these issues university is not a revenue generating outfit and for as long as we uh, push the idea that oh university is generating the only thing universities do is charge for services for instance students paid for id card you cannot but give them the id card so where is that money going to come from as we speak, I've said it over and over. On a monthly basis, University of Illinois spends between 100 and 130 million naira for electricity alone. How much can we charge students to be able to meet that kind of demand? If we really want to be global players, then we need to do things differently. And that is why I believe that we are positioning ourselves as a university to the point that we should be self-sustaining. The Vice Chancellor into the institutions moves on into real value addition farming on its arable campus land. It's going to be value addition farming, real commercial farming on our campus. We are uh, dealing with uh, maize and soya beans. As we speak, we already have another uh, arrangement with broad grains for about uh, 2,000 hectares. And all these are not just production in commercial quantity, but with value addition. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.